Hi you all. My name is Mary. This reading is for Libra. I hope everybody's doing great. We're going to pick the cards today you all. Please bear with me for a minute. It does take me a second to pick nine cards. But they're falling out like crazy for you guys. One fell right in my lap. One more. This one. All right, let's take two of these clarifying over here. <laughs> They're just flying out. All right, let's see what we got. Judgment. That's the one that fell in my lap when we first started. Knight of Coins, which is Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles. The World card. Temperance. Page of Wands. Eight of Cups. And two of swords. Make sure they're straight, you all. I think they are. I hope so. You're too clarifying. Happy family. And the world. You got two world cards here. Let's go with it this way. Can you see those? Sometimes it puts a shadow on them and you can't hardly see them very good. Give me just a minute, okay? You guys are in the process, I believe, of walking away from feeling isolated, from feeling financially um, strained. And all you want is to be able to feel uh, more balance and have more, feel more like yourself, possibly, than you have in quite some time. And for some reason, it's taken you a minute to get to that place. But guess what, you guys? With this judgment card in the middle, this is all about uh, feeling um, like you're coming from the dark and into the light. This is like starting brand new. This is a fresh start. This is like a rebirth card. So when I get the judgment, I get excited about it because I feel like things are changing and they're looking up. Things are lightening up in your, in your life and in your world and in your situation especially if it's finances and I'll be honest with you okay there's a lot of things going on right now and and a lot of people worried with our finances and feeling just a little bit um, just not right you know it can it can really put you in a sad state when it has something to do with your finances because obviously we need finances or money in order to live but here's the thing there's something changing right as we speak in your life that's going to absolutely put something behind you so you can move forward into this brand new life experience. This is something huge and, and even though it may be something small in your life, it's going to be huge. It's going to be a huge outcome is how I want to say it. Along with that, the two world cards, I get a little bit excited because there's blessings that come behind it. There's endings and there's new beginnings, and it all comes together with this world card. So if there is something in your life right at this moment that you're not feeling um, really good about, 
hang in there for a minute. Things are changing and things are about to change really fast and you're about to be in a much better uh, situation and in a much better predicament than you are right at this moment. Now I do believe you may be dealing with an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I have the Knight and I have the Queen down here so there may be an earth sign that's involved. Um, on the flip side of that, this could be your energy as well. You guys are, are going slow and steady. You're t making sure that you're doing the right things. You're making sure that all the T's are crossed and the I's are dotted. And you're, you're just making sure that you're um, doing everything the right way. With this page of wands over here at the end, now these could be younger people that you're dealing with. They could also be children, you know, younger energies. But I'm feeling like this page of wands about to bring in some kind of happy news for you all. Look at it this way, okay? This happy news could finish up a life cycle of yours that you're going through right now. Put that behind you to start out in a brand new life cycle. This could be a blessing that's coming in for you all, which could lead you to options. And a lot of times, you know, you may have heard me say this before, but sometimes with the Two of Swords, people kind of say, oh my, I've got two options. I don't know which one to take. But the good news about this Two of Swords is it's two different really good options, you all. It's almost like you're kind of torn on which one to take because they're both really good. So don't think that you, for a minute, that you guys are going to take the wrong option or that you guys are going to be in this feeling like this little bit of a pickle forever, you're going to, I feel, you're going to, um, it's almost like a hop, skip, and a jump. Here it comes, okay? So don't, don't uh, let this discourage you and don't let this um, put you in a little bit of a depressed situation or make you feel like, uh-oh, my money's running out. I'm going to take one for this Five of Pentacles real quick, okay? Let's take a card. I don't like them. Sorry. There we go. That one. Ace of Swords. So what is going to get you out of feeling like either you're isolated or lonely or your finances are not there or your finances are dwindling? There's going to be an epiphany or clarity situation or some kind of truth that comes out that's going to put you guys in a much better place. And that's how I feel. I mean, I felt it before I got this, right? Because when you looked at them this way, it's almost like all you want is more balance. All you want is to feel more like yourself. And then all of a sudden you get this five and then you get this eight of cups like you're saying, you know what, I'm walking away from this nonsense right here. I'm walking away from feeling isolated. I'm walking away from feeling like my finances are not on the up and up. Once you start realizing that you are going to be in a better place, and then this epiphany comes in or this clarity moment or this aha kind of thing that comes in, you're going to realize that you guys are about ready to go into this brand new fresh start and into this new life cycle. It's a beautiful, beautiful feeling that I have. I'm just trying to speak it like I feel it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop there and I'm going to take one for this Eight of Cups, okay? Sometimes with this Eight of Cups, this is just... Uh, walking away from nonsense is really how it is. It's not, it may not be necessarily walking away from anyone. Now, with me being just say that, I'm looking at it this way. You're walking away from feeling this five of pentacles. However, going this way, there may be some of you guys walking away from an earth sign, possibly. I, I'm not going to say that for sure. But there, that could go hand in hand, and that could be why you have a hard decision right here. Should I emotionally walk away from this person? And you've got in this little bit of a, which way should I go here? So let's take one for this Eight of Cups. Seven of Pentacles, which is harvesting your fruit. It can also be possibly money coming in, you guys. Just like I thought, though, really. Um... This is about a reward that you guys will be getting, should be getting. Um, this is about something that somebody's going to be paying you. Now, whether it's a pay raise, whether it's a bonus, 
maybe you um, you're getting a commission on something maybe you've done something in the past and now you're getting paid for you know working so hard something here makes me feel like you're about to get some kind of a reward financially okay so that in itself is going to put you in a better place with this five of pentacles let's take one more six of, of wands sorry i had to look at the card six of wands you know what that is do you guys know what that is that is victory that's success that could be leadership role that could be a new promotion for you guys that could be a new business that could be you guys being a leader of a bunch of people that's what i'm talking about you guys i, I just felt it before i even took some of these cards excuse me <coughs> Sorry. Sorry about that. So here's the thing. Even though sometimes you feel a little bit blue or a little bit sad or a little bit financially uh, pinched, hang in there for just a minute. And I mean that too. It's not going to be long. And then all of a sudden, I feel like you're going to be rewarded from, from some kind of work that you've done in the past or someone is going to notice you, someone is going to give you a new opportunity or give you a promotion on something. This could also be you guys being your own boss, doing something uh, specific that you guys may work um, and have people underneath you. You guys could be an owner of a company of some sort. But this is all about victory. This is all about success. And this is about achievement and and just being a leader. And, and this is all good stuff is really what I'm trying to say. And I'm stammering for some reason. But this is beautiful the way it is. I'm going to stop there. Let me look at these for a second. I think I might want to take one for that temperance card up there. Um, let's take one for that. Let me say something real quick before I do. This is emotionally walking away from a financial bad situation here, but it could be walking away from an earth sign. But it may be walking away from the financial issues so you can move forward with this earth sign. You've got this reward. You've got this um, leadership role or some kind of uh, victory card, success card. And then you've got the Queen of, of Pentacles along with the Two of Swords. This may put you in a, should I stay at my old job or should I get take this new promotion? Should I open my own business or should I, you know, you know, you know what I'm saying? You're going to have two different options here with this Two of Swords. And it could possibly have something to do with this uh, Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, that's all I needed to say with that. Let's take a Temperance. want that one. I wanted this one. There's two. Ace of Wands, you all. I don't even necessarily even need this one, but I'm going to take it anyway in just a minute. Look at this, you guys. You're going from feeling a little unbalanced or feeling like that that's all you want or need is more balance in your life. You're just trying to get the right um, concoction in order to make your life better basically then you get the ace of wands and you get the ace of swords and then you get the victory card down here this is not going to be an issue very much longer it you guys may step in and it may not be an issue because of things that are working um, quicker than some of these issues if that makes any sense sometimes you can avoid some of these things happening is what I'm trying to say Knight of Cups. So here's the thing too, okay? I have the Knight of Cups, but I also have this Ace of Wands. Here, look at the energies. You guys have younger energies. Are you guys um, going to be working with people? This kind of makes me feel like that. These could be people that you're hiring in that are, are people underneath you. Maybe they're employees. Maybe they're co-workers. Maybe this, the, the, you guys can, can put all of your abilities together and make something that is really, really good. But I do believe that 
people are involved in your in your life at this time whether they're helping you whether they are um, working for you possibly or maybe you're the leader of, of different people that that's going on right now either way with this ace of wands and this ace of swords there's all kinds of new chapters and new life experiences that's coming in right now you guys so to me it's almost like hang in there for just two seconds things are changing and things are changing fast your family's about to be happy this world card along with this world card is coming in saying that this a, a huge life experience is, is it's completing so you guys can start out in a brand new life experience i mean for heaven's sakes and here's a fresh start you guys oh, i'm going to take one for that knight of coins there knight of pentacles one will fall out now there we go <laughs> wow ace of pentacles i'm going to flip these around i hope you guys don't mind because they both fell out at the same time i do believe you're dealing with people this is a water sign cancer scorpio pisces but i want you to see what these look like look i mean really Ace of Swords, Ace of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, really? Just like I said earlier, every once in a while we always get a little bit uh, groggy, a little bit, sometimes a little bit angry, I'm going to be honest. And sometimes it's just a little bit cautious or a little bit concerned or a little bit um, frazzled because we're not exactly sure what we should do, you know? And especially with everything, all the prices going up and the, you know, you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, it does make you a little frazzled, i got to be honest. However, there's a known reason for you guys to be frazzled. Things are working out in your favor. All you need to do is put your mind to it. All you need to do is realize that there's something out there that is going to be fantastic for you. Whether this is a new job, a new promotion... Um, this could be a leadership role, like I said earlier, or this could be your own business. Whatever this is, you guys are going to be fantastic at it because you guys always look at every side of every angle of every situation, especially when it comes to jobs, careers, businesses, money, things like that. Um, and you guys are going to be able to pull yourself out of the darkness and into the light. You're, this is a resurrection, and that's exactly what, what you guys are doing. You guys don't need to worry about it much longer. Um, and you guys are going to be absolutely tickled. Three different chapters here, you all. Um, and then the world card saying this is a brand new life cycle. Two world cards, excuse me. Um, so honest to goodness, you guys are about to have some options. And, and you may be a little bit torn with the options that you're going to have. Because you're going to be like, well, this one is this, and this one is this, and it keeps going like this, right? You're, you're, you're weighing out your options, pros, cons, and it, they're both really, really good options. So whichever one you take will be the right one for you. But I also want you to realize that things are looking up in your life right at this moment. Things are looking up, new chapters are coming in, and your life, you're about to get some sort of good news here. In order for you to have this this good news and this um, these offers or these um, acknowledgments or these opportunities, if you're looking for something, start putting in your resumes. Start looking into if it's a business you're trying to open. Start looking into it. Start making um, the right moves towards whatever you're looking to do, because something is coming in and it's coming in fast. And in order for it to come in for you, you've got to be able. To, you've got to put something out there in order to get the answer or the acknowledgement that you're looking for. So whatever it is that I'm talking about for you. Um, it's really going to change your life in a really good way. And I feel like you guys are going to be absolutely thrilled with this outcome. And I do think you're going to be dealing with different people. You could have a lot of, you know, you have two knights and a page and then a queen down here. 
I think these people could be people that are working for you. I mean, they could be people in your family or your neighbors or your co-workers too. But I just feel like that they're, have, they have something to do with your success at this time. Um, I also believe that this, this earth sign here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, could be someone that um, is helping you get out of a little bit of a hiccup, a little bit of a bump in the road. They could be giving you this option of this new success here. It could be, and I'm sorry to say it this way, could be someone you're emotionally walking away from too. So it could go in two different directions here for different people. But I also feel like whatever way you decide to go, you're going to be uh, victorious here. You're going to be thrilled with the outcome. If it's this is someone in your family, a wife, a husband, or, or you know, I think your family is going to be thrilled with the way this is working out. And I think you guys are going to be absolutely tickled with the outcome here. This is a fresh start. This is a resurrection. And this is going from the dark into the light. This could be more money coming in for you. If nothing else, it's a lot more happiness, you all. Your family is going to be tickled about it. New life experience coming in and, and really good news coming in for you guys. Beautiful, beautiful reading, Libra. I hope you guys have enjoyed this today. If this does not resonate right at this moment, it may in the near future. Sometimes it's right around the corner and sometimes it's a little later on, you guys. Take care. I'll see you soon.